Welcome back, and we're not in the Mars area because I'm doing everything in my power to avoid exploring that area more because I don't really like it. It looks nicer, like it's a nice change of visuals, but everything else in it I despise. So I remembered I didn't kill the Erd Tree Demon here. So I was like, yeah, let's do that. Why not? Then, what was the other thing I forgot? There was one other thing. It's not coming back to me this second. For now though, let's try and do this, which unfortunately means clearing these assholes. Because I ain't having them attacking me while I'm trying to fight it. Oh, is he calling them all? No, okay, good. Oh, your horns are going. I see you're not ever stopping attacking, except when you delayed to wait for you to try and heal. How are your horns glowing? Weird. Oh, is it maybe because it's night? Eh. Just use my physics real quick. My psychic physics. Someone doesn't like when I say psychic, so I'm just going to keep saying psychic as many times as I feel like. Psychic, psychic, psychic. Wait, his horns are going too. They have weirder faces than I remember them having. Now the worst part is if I don't kill the Asylum Demon, we're going to have to do this every time. <laughs> yeah, they, they like power up. I must be because it's night, because I've never seen any of this enemy type do this. Not even when they're ghosts in the underground. hit through you as well, wow. Two more. Don't want to get too close. Because I imagine it will start throwing magic at me. Yeah, as soon as they get engaged, they do a little power-up. It gives them blue horns. Yes, hello, yes, hi, I'm here. I am pressing circle after every one of his attacks, for the record, just decides not to do it sometimes. The game does eat inputs. I said circle. I swear I've played more Souls games with a 360 controller than I have a PlayStation one, and yet I, I default to PlayStation naming conventions. Oh, have I? Yeah, definitely have. I mostly play Blood, uh, Bloodborne on the PlayStation controller. But I, I think that might be the only Souls game I've played with a PlayStation controller. No, and Demon Souls. Sorry. Both the original release and the remake. I guess they were fairly recent, so that's probably why I'm thinking of them. Alright, I'll summon the Distraction Squad. I'll try and fight him without being on the horse. We'll see what spells he has and then go from there. There isn't any hiding, is there? No. Okay. Can I maybe open with a... Yes, but I missed. I'd like to hit you once to test your metal. Okay, I can do good damage. But what spell you got? The butt slam. Does that do the spell? No. Okay. You did throw Thank you. I need to get back into. Oh, is this the. Yeah, this is the one. I need to get back in the habit of doing side rolls because I think there's a lot more enemies in this game that punish you for doing back rolls. Except this. <laughs> back roll with. Frank's kind of stopped me landing a hit there. This is the, the spell. Yeah. Frank, no! Oh, I can't see anything, but I believe he's dead. I 
Am I not supposed to get something? From my yeah, there we go. Magic shrouding cracked tear light. Oh, that's going to be resistances. Yeah, it's got to be. I think I ran round this tree before. Oh, and also in case this is a long episode for YouTube, I might have to go AFK to get an Amazon delivery that's late and it has perishables in it so I can't just like take it in and leave it. So I might go AFK for like three minutes, five minutes, uh, not five, five's too much, three maybe. Hello Seeker, uh, we just killed a boss five minutes in so that's not too bad but that's one I forgot about from earlier. Anything to put off going to the Mars area with the swamp. But that really is where I need to explore next, I guess. Oh, I did off camera, I was killing a bunch of birds because I've got um, 80 poison ar fletched poison arrows again now because I figured I'll need them sooner or later. So I did that off camera. I went back to the Magical Academy and farmed the souls I needed there to buy some stuff as well. And I got a level, which I put in HP, I think. Don't quite remember. Could not find the guy I gave the the key to to get into the academy. I ran around a little bit from all the bonfires, couldn't find him. So he's gone. Oh and also when I was in the round table hold I talked to Ronaldo or whatever his name is, the guy from the castle. I'm paraphrasing what he said to me but he basically said I'm gonna go hollow and try and kill you soon, sorry. So I'm expecting him to be vanished. In fact let's go check, let's see if he's gone now because I haven't been back since he said that to me. And he apologised in advance for the ass kicking he's going to get from me. His words, like he said, "Oh, you're you're very strong. You're going to beat me." He might repeat himself actually, so you can hear it if he's still here. He is still. Oh, he's slumped. I think he's on the way out. He wasn't like that last time. Hang on, let me rest here and see if he changes again. No. Well, that probably means we're going to run into him as an invader at some point, but who knows. I haven't found this guy either, not that I've really looked for him either, since he went missing. I was thinking about it though, and I wonder if it's because I gave him heretical works. And, well, I mean, it doesn't matter for my character, I suppose, but you should buy out merchants, or not the generic merchants, but the character merchants, I guess. Let's go to the damn swamp. Because there is a good chance they're just going to go wonders if their special characters or get murdered or, or turn evil or... And thankfully everyone I've met is a mage so it doesn't matter for me but for my other character I really do need to just like buy out their inventories. I guess if they turn evil you'll get their ball bearings anyway. But, you know, that might mean you have to wait until you find them of course. Where is this? Oh yeah, this is where I, I beat up Neil. And then we gave the thing to Gary and he said come back later, so we can go do that. Uh, this is presumably later. Who's that over there? There's a guy over there. Oh, he's leaving a trail of butterflies. Who the hell are you? Oh! You're fast! You're You're more dangerous than the boss was. Oh, is that still taking off? I was fine. He's got destructive disc magic! The best worst spell from the Dark Souls 3 DLC. Uh, I can cure that. Oh, but Liammy. Sadly, yes. Like the portions of the game where they look so nice. Well, not nice. They look so. Oh, you're just a guy. They look so different you want to stop and admire, but everything is so obnoxious to fight you've just got to run past it. But you don't have to, but it's preferable. Yeah, I think he'll probably respawn if I rest here. But I want to quickly check what my Sysic can do with those things I got. Yeah, so it's for if you want to boost your defences against specific boss types. 
Okay. Yeah, there he is. He is just a normal dude. So there's probably more to find in this swamp, which is what we're here to do. I haven't checked this area. We obviously found the main thing, which was the boss that was here. Can I pick up his? I have expected them to be traps and explode or something. Oh, they're all... What? Examine what? Oh, it's the summon site. They're all up in this place, apparently. Are you an enemy? This thing here? No? No? Okay. Yes, pumpkin man. That is suspicious. You're no longer a pumpkin man? Traitor. Oh, you can put po wait, you can put poisonous mist on your weapon? How does that work? Also, what's that sound? Leave the armament and poison then slash Okay, so yeah, it's not just a spell anymore then. So I saw one of those big, yeah, poison spitters over there. We're at the edge already. To, I don't think I checked this area though. Let me just quickly run down here. Oh yeah, there's more of them over here. This looks like there should be something. Oh, something's aggroed thing over there I think. It's one of those mannequins here. Oh hang on this is where the thing chucks stuff at you from the hill yeah and there's a merchant up here. Somewhere. Wasn't there a merchant? Wait I died up here? I don't remember dying next to the merchant last time. Little Todd Bomb. Oh, it's underground somewhere. It was Wait, they're in the Radan? No, they're right here. Thank you, Bamog, for resubbing for 66 months with a tier 1 sub. I think I died in a dungeon or something and just didn't go back. Oh, there's a merchant there, yeah. Apparently I'm right on top of them and they ain't here, so... Oh, that's right, it was 37... Yeah, okay, yeah. I don't need them. What can I buy off you before I go back in the poison swamp? Yes, I'll buy that. What's their name's armor? Eh. Flaming bolts for the crossbow? Nah. He even speak to me there? Check, like, roughly there. It looks like there's ruins. Now, the only person I'm murdering is Patches. Well, I can't guarantee that. For now, the only person I'm murdering is Patches. Crab. Patches locked me in the room in the castle. And is just untrustworthy in general. By the castle, I'm meaning Stormville. He's not trusty patches, he's, tr he's patches the... Is that just a skull? Yeah. What does he call himself in this one? The... the... something? It's not the hyena. And it's not the spider. But it is patches the something. Did I get that bonfire? Oh, no I didn't. The untethered. Yeah, that's not complimentary to say you're untethered. Hey, 
Right next to an enemy. That's not a safe bonfire. Touch grass. Alright, well that begs the question, why is there a bonfire here? There's still s- oh, there's a ghost there too. Hello, Mr. Ghost. Only one last time, your splendid blade dancing among the scarlet raw. Is he talking about- uh, he's probably talking about, uh, Neil. Is he looking towards the Neil fight? Yeah. Okay, definitely runes. That's a man. Yeah, that's one of those things from that poison dungeon earlier. Bet they're stronger than the ones I fought there, though. No, actually not really. Hmm. Oh, I can summon my, my posse here. Oh, hello. How's my watch beeping at me? It's not worth summoning them to fight flowers that poison, though. You're planning on respecking so you can use a giant S-Grey sword? Look, if you love Maz that much, why don't you just marry him? Yoink, meteorite staff. There do be flowers everywhere. I should also mention I'm not hearing the game in my right ear because I have a headphone off so I can hear my door. So if I don't hear anything specifically on that side, that's why. Oh, there's stairs. I'm being chased by boogers! It's not attacks. Okay, there's a big plant over there. I imagine the stairs is the reason why this is over here, though. Let me remove that marker because we found what is this called? Street of Sages Ruin. Oh, that's the other thing I was doing from last time. We need to hit the other two of those towers in the here. Yeah, there. I hate that the background music for this area is someone kind of screaming. Why is the chest to the side? It's not usually to the side. Okay, Rock Sling. It's one of those gravity spells. They're int spells, right? Yeah, pure int. Just a different flavour to your normal. Yeah, that's my to-do list. Check, check in with Gary after I've rested at a few bonfires or some in-game time has passed. And check the town. I think we might just go back to the town now because I think this, is er this area is checked. Although, at that other bonfire I just got... I don't think I've checked around this path here. Also on the to-do list is that two cat dog boss that I found way too long ago and didn't do because I wasn't ready for it. I feel like it would still be... Oh, an armor set. Traveling garb of a shop. And perfume bottle. I feel like it will be annoying but probably doable now with the leveled up posse and my, my weapons. Why is it still playing combat music? Yeah, there we go. Chat, that's on the rest of you as well to help remember. Hello, I'll take that. I'm hoping for no horse-based bosses. What? Yes, right this way. Right this way. That sounds suspicious. Moving for no, no, there's just a merchant sitting here. No horse based bosses today. Had a little bit of headache since this uh, this afternoon. I've taken in uh, paracetamol for it, but Welcome. I don't want the spinning camera from fighting a horse boss. Come, trade in. This one's a lot more talkative than the other merchant. Please, buy something. He also hungry. sounds more desperate. I've been hungry so long. Please. I do actually need more of them. 
Ooh, wait, what's this? Oh, wait, this is to poison enemies. I can afford only one of them. Uh, can I sell some duplicate armor to you real quick? Do I have duplicate armor? Yep. Wait, have I upgraded one? No, I can't upgrade these. I think that's enough now on its own. That is way too expensive for a, essentially a poison cure, incidentally. <laughs> no wonder nobody buys from you. I see the lines of another grace right there. Huh. They're very close together. I had a dupe, did I? Well, there's only a hundred souls, it's fine. The Battle of Ionia, Radan and Melania locked in a stalemate, then the Scarlet Rock blooms. They did the nasty in the pasty and created the Nuthalurgi. Fair enough. Yeah, sure. I'll rest at the bonfire. I don't think I used any heals back there, but that's okay. So what have we got in this generator? There's normal sized dogs that... Oh, and there's, there's one of those centipede things. I thought I was free of them after finishing that dungeon last time. Thank God I killed that boss first try, incidentally. Okay, let's uh, deal with you. Don't make me destroy you. Ash of War Life Steel Fist. The, the attack that the final boss of Demon Souls spans, spams. Skill that demonstrates the mastery of the art of controlling vital energies, a slow controlled punch. Steals their HP, only effective against foes of human build. You saying I can't punch a beast? I haven't played Generation Zero for quite some time, but it is a game we played a lot of. I'm not saying we'll never go back to it, but no immediate plans. He's just walking his dog. A centipede demon walking his dog. <clears throat> Hello, Mixer. Oh, there's two of them up there. This road is dangerous. Where does it lead? There's got to be stuff here. There's too much empty space. There's a ruin right there. more bloody is that the same poison swamp no that's more poison it's like that family guy joke when he's digging in the bag for needles and he just keeps on saying no oh, that's, that's more needles it's a it's a very slowed down town full of those irritating assholes but that means there's probably something here so let's explore for a little bit oh yeah I was considering giving myself one MP Estus because if I get killed by a boss, I, I don't remember the last time it was because I ran out of heals. It's usually because I die... Oh, there was a hidden dog there. So I die before I get a chance to go through all my Estus. He had a purple on him? Oh. Okay. Fair enough. Mookster is very consistent with only using wave emotes. He's a lurker, but he likes to wave hello. That's okay. i got no problem with that. don't see anything down there. Oh, there is more rooms though. There's got to be stairs at some point. You're a caster, you're two doggles. Get him, Franks! Oh, there's another one. I did that for five great dragonfly heads. Ah, uh, that's slightly more dangerous. I love it. <laughs> that I'm always ever so slightly off with the maximum range of that. Every single time it's millimeters. Here comes Scarlet Rock, it doesn't kill them, it kills you. They've got the Lurgy. 
The real question is why aren't these spamming the irritating... Oh, he's gonna do it. No, he isn't. He's attacking. Why are they not spamming the irritating range attack the other ones were? Maybe they're definitely right. Thanks for the help, guys. Ooh. Well, they've clearly seen something. One guarding an item on a cliff. Find that hard to believe, but let's see. Oh, uh, hidden doggo. Oh, he's got the attack. Still lying next to me, Sora. No, good. I'm gonna move my chair back a little bit. There we go. Gotta be careful about that. I did that for one times thin beast bone? Oh wait, no. Here we are. Poison Blossom times four. Do I recognize over there? Yeah, I do. That's the mist woods over there. Because that's the castle, that's the lift down, that's the herb tree that's there. The game is pretty. It's, it's, and this era is pretty in its own way, just in terms of like it looks neat. Disgusting, but that's by design. And it's enjoyable when there's no enemies that are irritating and just will not stop attacking, biting your ass while you're trying to look at all the weirdness. The trees stand out better when the sky's red as well. Oh, there's the stairs. Guarded. By only one enemy? I'd like to believe that, but I don't. Get him, Franks! Get him! Yeah, not that my mother watches my videos or live streams chat, but it is my mother's birthday today, so wish her a happy birthday. She has reached one of the notable ages. Hey, one of the Franks just disappeared into the tunnel. Yep, she finally turned 30. Ooh, I don't like this. Zombies? No, it's filled with centipedes and other such demons. Oh, it's baby centipedes! That's disgusting. Is there any adult ones? No, the baby ones are standing there. to send her a certain song that is connected to the age she's turned, but I don't think she would find it as funny as I would. She also asked for absolutely nothing for her birthday. And I did the usual, like, are you are you sure? Are you pretending that there's actually something you do want? I was like, nope, none at all. Meteoric or blade. That sounds neat. I also am like that, for the most part. So I must have got it from her. Skills with strength and int mostly, split physical magic damage. Oh, it looks cool. That's annoying. It is a katana, but it's not one I can use, really. Gravitas. Thrust the armament into the ground to create a... Oh, I've seen that skill before. One of the, the summon that you get to help you against the double boss in the cave does that, I think. That's a cool looking katana. It's a shame that it sucks. It also needs 18 int. But I could use that on an ink character, I suppose, if I still want to stay weeb. So they just kind of... yeah, it's like Mirelurk eggs. They just kind of popped out the graves. Ugh. It is a strength int and ever so slightly dex katana, yeah. We're not safe. 
because the Franks would have despawned if we were safe. Haha, <laughs> I'm in danger? No, not here. Oh. Well, there is dudes going up this hill here, but what purpose? There's mages all the way up. Is that a fog wall? That's a weird looking wall. I don't think it's a fog wall though. We'll check that after I check up here. No boogers. You have shot a booger at me. Uh, oh yeah, actually, that's a good thing to have reminded me of. Hang on, I need to kill this person. Because there is a way to pause the game by accident. And I might need to do it depending on when my delivery shows up. We could test it now, but I need practice. Only if you're playing in offline solo mode, but still. Booger! Use the Sisic so I can outlast the poison. Hello, Lily. And thank you for wishing her a happy birthday. So, if I do this, now you have to go to inventory and then that. And then the game should be paused. It does seem. No, it's not paused because I can still move. I think I've been lied to. Or do you have to press on menu explanation? That paused it. Now you can tell it's paused because I can't move in the background. Okay. So I go like that, so you have to go to inventory quickly, press back, menu. Yeah, you can see the plants stop moving. Okay, that's fine, I'll do that if I get, if I have to run and grab the door. The map? You can't pull the map up while you're in combat though. What happened to my franks? Do they die or just despawn? I'm going to assume despawn because I came too far away from the ruins. Why were these things up here though? It didn't seem like they were guarding anything. So as with all Souls games, poison lasts way too long. Like a stupidly long period of time. Oh, it's one of the stone thingy doors. That's why it's not a fog wall piss colour. It is Mars, yeah. Grace instantly. Prison cave. Okay. Now, I would like to alt tab and check the progress of my Amazon order to know if I should be worried about the door getting entered soon, but I did this before recording for YouTube and it crashed. The game, that is. Let's quickly test to make sure I am okay. No, I'm not, because it's two stops away. That's an awkward amount of time. Good to know, though. Be safe, chest. The safe. The chest is safe, rather. Rune Arc. How many of them am I sitting on now? Twelve. Grants the blessing of the equipped great rune. I have Godric's equipped, I believe. Yes. Used to perfect rebirth. Uh, sure. This one just raises your stats or something. Yeah, it raises all attributes. Oh, I didn't click back to chat. There we go. It just means you can respec if you're in that rune. I guess that makes sense. So we want to explore this, I suppose, but again, I am going to have to stop and answer the door in a second. I'm, I'm debating making a shorter episode for YouTube real quick because it's just we're at 35 minutes which is a lot shorter than usual we did kill a boss what would annoy youtube more a shorter episode or having to go afk for like three four minutes while i bung stuff in the fridge let's see if there's what's in here rats with glowing eyes I'm 
guessing there's about 17 more hidden somewhere. I heard something drop. AFK is easy to skip. If someone in the comments time marks like he goes AFK here and comes back here, then yes. That's true. I'll try and be quick. I find it suspicious that there's just like single rats in each of these corridors. I could. You think I'm going to remember? This is like part 27 or 28 and what part went live just before I streamed? Like 11 at most? 10? <laughs> Never gonna remember that. It's not part five, it can't possibly be part five. Surely not. It has to be higher than that. Oh, I hear something strange. That would be someone screaming. Have I been lured into a trap? Yep. There was stuff back there I hadn't finished exploring. It was part 11. Okay, well, I'm not completely mad then. It sounded familiar. That means part 12 will be out when I finish streaming. Actually, no, I don't think today was a double day. I did a, I, there is occasional double days because there is such a backlog because I've been playing it so much. But in my defense, it's really good. It's it's faults and, and bad stuff are... Ooh. They're far outweighed, this is like prison in Dark Souls 2. Far outweighed by everything that is good about this game. We are in the parts of the game that are more likely to be annoying, but that doesn't change that the first 40, 50 hours was great. I am quite mad. Yeah, probably. I'm not going to argue with that. Yeah, since I haven't been playing it, oh, since I haven't been playing anything else besides this, I don't have anywhere else to mention. But I did play Bard Song today, which is a miniature game for anyone unaware. So we're talking about nerd stuff very quickly. It's, I'll, I'll say just very brief. We'll talk more about it on Saturday with Valinar probably. It was the combat is more basic than I thought. But the exploration and events and such are more entertaining than I thought. And I moved my videos around so the the thing I recorded today will be up on Monday. We're just playing the combat tutorial and then playing the exploration tutorial, which also has a fight in it. Can't reach them. This is going to be like the prison in Dark Souls 2, where I'm going to open up all these damn doors and then they're going to come and get me. Hello, Daniel. You're playing Horizon Zero Dawn. Presumably you mean the new one, right? Like the rest of us are playing Elden Ring. I should ask what other games you want to see me stream this week. Oh, wasn't there a statue up top? Also, someone switched the mist on? Ow. That's why there was mist. There was a vulgar knight behind me. Because people aren't as uh, enthusiastic about Elden Ring as I had hoped they would be. Especially because I ended up enjoying it. So I need suggestions for other things. But I do have one new game to try. Uh, something that caught my eye. So we'll be trying that tomorrow probably. But beyond that, this is another drop. Hang on, have I checked everywhere back here? Couldn't open that door came from that way, they're, they're all closed. Does it matter what you want? Yes! Honestly, from a financial point of view, considering subs are way down for the month. So unfortunately it matters. Hello kitty! Hello little man. I will destroy you! 
Don't know what that does. I thought this would put you to sleep or something, but I think it is just it a mask from attacking. Oh, on that note, thank you, Magpie, for resubbing. Praise the pumpkin. I don't have a praise emote. Uh, this will have to do. That's the fisting emote. When you get bored of saying try fingers. I'm expecting the little man hiding around every corner now. I'm glad you're enjoying it. There hasn't even been that much salt because I've never been stuck on a boss for longer than like 10 minutes. I have called like two of them C-words, but that's just because they annoyed me. I still beat them very quickly. And I've mostly been complimentary about the game as well. It's in Nice Death. That isn't the one where you have to you play as death and like do your Final Destination stuff, is it? Because I did play it. It had a little bit of a dodgy translation, but it was pretty fun. I don't know why everyone's on fire, but if you hit them enough, they explode. We saw them outside the castle last time. Yeah, I was trying to think, like, when was the last time I enjoyed a game enough to be wanting to play, like, another character off-stream, do nothing but streams of it, and I think the only other answer... Is this going to fall again? The only other answer is, like, Monster Hunter World, I think? Not even Rise, just Monster Hunter World? Game lagged a little bit when I came in here. Oh, hello little man. You're a lure and there's probably more of you. Take this. Oh no, I think I heard a truck. I definitely did, I think. Inventory, help, menu explanation. Did I hear a truck? I'm hearing noises, but I'm not... Oh, yep, there we go. All right, chat, I'll be back in a few minutes. Apologies for YouTube. BRB. I rushed back, so I need a minute, but I am here. Ugh. I didn't really need to rush. But I did. To stop people telling jokes. That's in theory my job. Why is it lagging in here? It wasn't ordering bananas. You must know it's vitamin drinks. I have one with breakfast every morning. Oh, I thought you activated. Also, there was no rush to Oh! There was no rush to answer the door because the guy was already in his van and leaving. Lean, mean, filthy militiamen. 
The upward extension serves to create the appearance of a larger size, however slightly. Lean mean militiamen. And he's gonna self explode, yeah. I didn't see the pun, Bluejack. Where's the pun? What do you call several gourd related to each other? Pumpkin. Sounds compensating. If you mean compensating for a bad diet, that would be it, yes. In truth, it's because I never used to eat breakfast, which is terrible. Don't do that. And then I discovered little yogurt drinks and I started having them, but then I was like, I might as well have a vitamin drink because then at least I'm getting vitamins. And I've been doing that for years and years and years. That's really suspicious. What was he running from? Oh, no, that's not a person. There's a big rat over there. Hmm. My time to shine! Son of a bitch! Every friggin' time! I'm out of mana. Ow! You're not allowed to hit me while I'm out of mana. You wouldn't hit a man with no mana, would you? It's a gigantic building sized great sword. How can I possibly keep misjudging the distance? Sure, when it's not charged enough, I get that. I was going to say, come here, you little shit, but you're very clearly not little. Check Steam. If you crash the game, I'm it's on you. Uh I see that I have a gift, but it's just a black screen. Oh, there we go. You got me Death and Taxi's Halloween update. Ha Halloween? Oh, thank you. Here's something I'd be interested in seeing you in play. Enjoy the bureaucracy of the afterlife. Thank you. <laughs> the gift of nothing. I'll look into it after the stream. Thank you, Daniel. What's that quote from? Oh, it's a quote from Death Day, the song by Death Clock. Here's your birthday present. It's a box of effing nothing. Turtleneck meat. Oh, uncoot. Uh, that's, that's traps. These are, these are traps. There we go. Hello, little man. I will destroy you! He jumps higher than me. But you're dead. I win by default. Lag again. PC version, plus. Oh. You're already counting down Halloween? I like Halloween in general, but it's also when Gotham Knights is finally releasing, so... Now I've got two reasons to look forward to this year. It's a shame we have to wait that long, though. I also noticed that they gave a release date for Gotham Knights, but not a release date for the Suicide Squad game. It doesn't bode well for it. I think that game is in trouble. <laughs> it still might end up being good, but I don't think it's it's where it needs to be. Speaking of which, a Suicide Squad nude box just got revealed for... Oh, this is going to open the cages. For the Batman miniature game. So if you wanted a miniature of Idris Elba or um, Peter Capaldi, it's going to exist next month. Okay, yep, they, they are free now. Now, is there anything back here I missed? Because I think there was another route of the rat door. Jump 
over these. Why don't, yeah, why don't I just jump over them? He, well, I mean, he's, he's in a suit with tennis shoes. Sure, he has a bunch of things in his brain, but you could snip those off and pretend he's the doctor. Mm, I could have sworn I missed something back here. I guess I have now the doors have opened. No immolation, please. I am here to make friends. Tier 4? Rainbow Stone. That was obvious. Oh, a drop down though? I can't get back. Hmm. Alright, we'll try it. Last time I did a room like this, it led down to the bear boss fight. Which feels like 20 years ago. It's the same chamber, actually, so it might be a bear again. Really wish I had the posse, if it is. Frenzied Duelist. You are not a bear. Well, I mean, you might be, I guess. I don't know how hairy you are. Oh, you're also very weak, but probably hit like a truck. I'm sorry I called you weak! Of course you double attack, because everything's a double attack that you think is a single attack. You bleed real good. This will heal up more than enough heals. If I die, it won't be to running out of them, like we were discussing earlier. You don't really deserve a Thanos snap, but you still get one. Hello, Rogalth. Yeah, I should have found him a long time ago. So there is more to this. Why is it purple? Let's to go back. I hope the doors stay open. Limgrave? Oh. Regalia of Eochad? <laughs> Eochuid? Oh, you know what? When I've been wandering around on my other character, I saw this purple item up here and didn't work out how the hell to get here. I tried to, like, Skyrim up the sides or drop down from above and you can't. Yeah, I know where we are. That's the third church over there. Yeah, I, I've seen this item, so that's how you get it. My glowstone. Let me check the sort of Echo Chad. Which is that one? E scaling and str oh, it's an arcane weapon, so it doesn't really do anything currently. Split physical magic damage. Infuse the sword with energy, then fling it forwards in a corkscrew. That sounds neat. Do I have any MP? No. I'll rest, well, or when I went rest, remind me to test that skill to see what it does. Alright, take me back to the start of a dungeon, but hopefully not respawn the enemies. Because I want to uh, see what was in the cells without having to fight the rats and vulgar knights again. Not that they were a problem. You know, that's reminded me as well, when you first start the game, there's an item up on a ledge behind where you start. Never worked out how to get that. There must be a, a hidden path once you get... Ah, oh, it did respawn everything. Well, I oh, might as well rest then. And then we'll see if the doors are open, if it's worth going back. I don't care that I can't wield it. Give me it! Scimitar attack style. Turns it into a lightsaber. Okay, pretty cool. It's a shame it's arcane. Hello, Trivet. Okay, let's see if the doors stayed open. I presume they have. Pardon me, but that also means all those dudes I killed will be back to. I think... Oh, 
Yoink. Is this where the drop down was? Yeah. So this wasn't open before. Hello, my self immolating chums. Got a case of the explodies. It could be, yeah. Wait, yeah, there was still this door. Could I, have I could have opened that when I was up there with a switch, couldn't I? But I dropped down instead of opening it. Oh well. Pillory shield. That's not a shield. That's used to keep people still. I came in from that way. Yeah, there's holes in it. They could stab right in it. Now, the real question is would these things attack the vulgar knights? No. I think they came out of this one. Yeah, nothing there. And this one. Nothing. Yeah, I think I should have come to this done. Well, how could I have though? The well, I guess it is very close to the border there, so it's not as difficult as further in the Mars area. But yeah, I clearly should have come here quite a while ago. He, he came down from above. I'm going to have to go around again, but I don't want to miss anything, so I will. Okay, now that I know those are just smoke bombs, I'm not scared of them. Uh, I did know there was a Gundam game of some variety. I think I saw it on Twitter, but I don't know anything about it. Next, ask me how many Gundam games I've played. I think the answer is between 0 and 1. It's Overwatch, but it's Gundam? I mean, if you have mechs, then that's not so bad. Oh, but it's going to be by Namco Bandai, right? So it's going to be heavily monetized. Because I think it's Namco Bandai that has the Gundam license. He's running at me! Yeah, it might be. I literally know nothing about it. It's the first I'm hearing of it. Oh! I, I deflated them. How many Gundam games have I not played? There's many. I think I played the demo of the Gundam, the first Gundam game that was basically Dynasty Warriors. And it was okay, but not enough to want me to buy it. Hmm. Okay, I paid for one of them to get in, so that's me. Re oh, the Wakazashi! You're not coming towards me. You are, but you're going to take forever. the way. Wait, the Wakazashi is the small one, right? I forget my, my weeb weapons. Yeah. Descaling. It's got fleet of foot on it. What What's up with my the text on this? It's, it's not formatted correctly. Okay, well if I get a katana that makes me replace my primary katana, that would be a good offhand if I don't do the pure Uchi katana run. Oh, 
It was worth coming back for just to know it's there. So the ones holding the arms rush at you. Weep too, weep hard. The little men with the sickles are running at me again. That one's running away. Also, I don't think the prisoners are going after them. Going. Oh, another one of their vulgar homes. Let's see here. Now my paralysis demons look like Rudyard Kipling. Oh, this is where you drop down if you let the floor collapse. That's where they came out of. This is where the rat ran past, I think. No, this was just a loot room. The cake guy... Uh, no, I think. Honestly, I just said the first name that came to mind that I thought would be funny. Back to lurking. Everyone watch him, he's lurking. Okay, that's down to the boss. I could have sworn there was more I missed, though. Yours looks like my Dark Souls 3 character. Excuse me, if you're talking about the one that's the thunk emote, that was Dark Souls 2. The best character creator to have existed. Oh, you're very welcome, Silent Mouse. Thank you for the nice message. I'm sorry to hear you're having to quarantine, though. But it's not too serious. I presume it's because you might be exposed to COVID. Ah! That was my chance to do it right this time, and I messed up. It doesn't even give you poise. Why do sorceries suck? Well, you made me set my katana on fire. I hope you're happy. A gift for you. So thank you, a spooky ghost, for giving a tier one sub to Silent Mouse. They mostly watch on YouTube, as they said, but if you're here for a little while because you're quarantined, you can use my emotes for a month. Uh, courtesy of whoever chose to be anonymous. Probably... Lojack. Oh no. I fell down. Now I'm scared of some bombs, I don't know where they are. Those rats had the lurgy, maybe. One of them had glowing eyes. So I could open this door, right, to have a shortcut right back here. Yep. Yep. I like rats, I just wish they didn't piss and pee on you all the time, that's all. They're very nice. I grew up around rats because my sister always had rats. Actually, connected to what we were talking about earlier with the Suicide Squad. I love when... Oh, there's a bad texture. When uh, Ratcatcher 2's rat offers Idris Elba a flower and he just so earnestly asks what the fuck would I do with a flower? Like he just, he sounds so genuine the way he says it, I can't help but laugh. Because he just sounds so exacerbated. I've now lost a bit down to the boss. And I need to find it because you can't teleport out. Uh, down here? Mm, maybe? It's in the hole behind the wall, wherever that is. Wow, whoever came through here really made a mess of things. 
You trying to insult Sora by saying you taught a, a dog how to play fetch properly? You you just directly insulting her like that? Oh, there it is. No, this is not it. This is where you would fall. I've watched a few clips from the Peacekeeper show on YouTube and I would personally say no. Unless you find swearing funny. Swearing and gore. Oh, hang on a second. <laughs> Is there any reason for me to have done this? No. I need an escape rope from Pokemon. Sora knows a lot of words and a lot of commands, it's just that she doesn't fully understand the intricacies of fetch is all. Like she knows sit. I think she knows lie down because I say that to her when she gets on the bed at night and she plops down right next to me. She knows the name of her meals. I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure she understands one hour or more. I've told the story before, but when she tries to get me up too early, I say that to her, and she she tries again, dead on an hour later. She's like an alarm clock. I am actually lost. Please help me. Where is the way out? Where is the way down to where the boss was? There's no map, and I can't teleport. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I think it's in here. Yes, yes, there it is. Oh no, I mean the name of her meals, you know, breakfast, lunch, dinner. I said in a slightly subdued voice so she's not listening. What a big arena for such a little man. Hmm. Alright, we are we are done here. Should maybe go buy out all the arts from that Art of War dude if he's still alive? I don't think I'd ever use them, but he's the only merchant I've found that's named that is relevant to my character. How many souls am I sitting on? Almost a level. We should probably spend those real quick. Oh yeah, she also understands that word, yes. When I, if I ever said that to her, she would run upstairs and hide in her cage. I believe that's from Dark Souls 2. That's not quite enough. 23, 4, 6... Does she know the word treat? Mm, yeah, biscuit, not treat, I would say. Oh, she also knows the word bed. But she associates that with going to her cage because I'm getting ready for bed. And then she gets a, a couple of little treats. <laughs> yeah, dogs pick up on... Words and actions. What is that? Oh, there's another one. I totally forgot we even saw one of them once. There's a... Hello. Remember, like, right back at the start of the game, I think there was one of those on the beach and I couldn't work out how to do it. I'm going to try it again when it comes around. Is it gone? Oh, I think I missed my opportunity. Unless it's on a really, really... Oh, wait, hang on. Oh, here it comes. Where did it go again? I saw it. Oh. Aha! Flames of the Red Mains. Fire affinity, produce a powerful burst of flames in a wide arc. 
Oh, I think, yeah, some of the, the larger lads here do that. The, the, the night guys. Okay. Fire's not my bag. Well, I guess it kind of is. Fire and bleed go well together in this game. Hmm. But I like my magical greatsword because it looks cool, even though I misjudge its distance every single friggin' time. Did I finish searching everything here? It still looks like there should be more, like, in this general area. I should probably get back on that road and have a look. So let's do that. We'll, we'll make this episode go like an hour and a half for YouTube, since I did go AFK for a few minutes. I should learn to only order stuff from Amazon on Sundays so it arrives on my day off. Because there's, it's just they're so overworked that it's always a late delivery slot now. Is that the merchant who I just? Yeah, that was the plight merchant. And then this is the road with the centipede walking his dog. We got distracted, but we didn't go this route. I'd say that every time. Oh, you mean about Amazon? And then I just end up ordering when. I, what is? That? Oh, there's a pumpkin man over there. Pumpkin man. Well, that's because when I need things, I just order it. I see you have a mage friend. You have mage friends. Well, they've gone mad. They're, they're no longer friends. Oh, there's, there's quite a lot of people here, actually. What you doing? So, what's that up on the cliff? There's an item up on the cliff there. They're just kind of setting light to the rot, I think. Pumpkin brother, you take them out, I'll distract them. You didn't die? Even what are they doing over here? Got quite a few things from him there. brother I mean you no harm I guess I just really want a sanctuary stone out because I'm presuming that's all you drop oh he actually has an animation if you're on the floor it just insta kills you well he's not my brother anymore he's gonna die and I will do it on the horse to prove it can be done because I would kill him very quickly if I just did the two-handed combo I had no idea they had an insta-kill, which makes them tacky, but whatever. Not many enemies seem to have those. Did I even have souls? Didn't I just get a level? I have to take out the mages, they're annoying. Especially this one that didn't even know I was there. Yoink. Eh, not very much. Does he hit them? Is more important. He does not. Ow. Could you get out of the way? I'm trying to have a fight on the pumpkin. Or with a pumpkin, not on a pumpkin. That'd be ridiculous. That's the Art of War I just got that they're doing as well. Goodbye. Yoink. Actually, I will kill you. He got in my way. It makes your life forfeit. I recognize that fire breathing animation from a previous Souls game, but I don't remember which. My horse. Use the Sysic to get healed. I presume the regen I have on that stacks with the regen for my charm. It was in Sekiro. Okay, it doesn't look as nice down there. Have I been down there? Sort of. 
that a bonfire up ahead? I think it is. It is. Touch grass. Okay, so I definitely have been missing bonfires. May as well show you what this. Oh, didn't even see her there. I'll show you what that telescope does. I've only used one off camera on my other character. Please, you... Yeah, touch my damn fingers. Oh, bless you. Can you try and sound less horny about it? The answer is no. Are you one for festivals? Yeah, I've already been there. I have access to that boss because I cheesed the game by accident. To the south. He's a key for Can see her toes. Festival. Yeah, okay, yeah, I know. I, I've been there. Yeah, I've, I've... Yeah, I know. Thanks. See, told you I haven't used it on this character before we got the tutorial. It gives you a bird's eye view, which makes no goddamn sense, but whatever. I don't know if I've been up to that castle up there. Do we have stairs? We do have stairs. They're right there. Okay. What's that there? Is that one of those... I think that's one of those Iron Maiden things. What the hell is that doing there? It's weird. Where is that in relation to me? Right in there. I want to go have a look at that. I won't kink shame him. Unless there's a cutscene like in the Dark Souls 3 DLC, then I will. Angry doggo in the way. I just want to know if it's aggressive. Not the doggo. Obviously that is. Yeah, that is as well. What the hell is this doing here? It's been killing doggos by the looks of it. Yeah, it is active. Weird. It's walking at me menacingly. Great time for the shield to run out. Oh, they're Fido. Watch them fight. Let them fight, I mean. Nope. You have very poor targeting priority. That thing's been killing your kind. I'm just walking by. And now you've put aside your differences to kill me. Whatever. There might be something special for killing that one, because it does seem very out of place. My inkling was, oh, what if there's someone trapped inside it, but they didn't give any hint of that, so... We'll go for what I saw instead, which is the stairs up here. That's just more dogs over there, although there is a lot of them. Can't fit. Okay, I need the horse. Aha! Oh, hello. Didn't see you there, but you also didn't see me, so we'll call it a draw. Oh, there's a boss! Oh dear. Pumpkin Bros, no! Another one of those just get staggered to death fights. Walk onto the enemy. Ah, oh, didn't do that much damage against them. At least I hit him though. 
6,300? What were you guarding is the question. Which reminds me, I should go back to that trapped NPC. I keep forgetting. Yeah, it's a shield of one of those things? That's horrible. Oh, it is. Oh. oh, it's got two fingers coming out of its mouth. It looks like cigars. Tongues of fire. Ready to shield, then spray violent jets of fire. From the quote-unquote tongues. Hold to continue spraying. You and me both. Can we see it on your arm? Oh my god, it's huge. Bleh. This would be blowing fire if I did have some MP. He's too dumb to know how it works. Blah, 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 blah. What kind of defences does this have on it? 100% physical block, it needs 44 strength to wield correctly. That actually has really good defence all around, that's a good shield. It's a shame it's disgusting. The shield looks like chat. Wow. Said by Woodkin, not me for the record. Yeah, before I forget, again, I'm going back to that lady that was a prisoner now that I've been to the Magic Academy. Where the hell was that? It was where the turtle was, and the turtle was here. It's somewhere near this thing. This is a great way to terrify your enemies. Wear that. Well, you could have the jellyfish shield as well, that's pretty weird. Pumpkin head, face shield. I'm sure there's a weird looking armour. Now, where in relation to this though was the ruins that had that lady? Because it had all those zombies and the zombies are over here. It's somewhere here. Oh, it's those ruins. That's the ones. Witchbane. different dialogue. I don't think she said persist last time. Still not giving me any option to do anything about it. Has anyone tried hitting her? Can you hit her to free her? And by free her I mean not kill her? They talk to the guy whom you told about how to get in yet. Yes, he took the key and vanished. Hitting her will make her aggressive, you've tried. How can the hell the how the hell can she be aggressive when she's stuck to the wall by your wrists? Okay, so that doesn't work. Fair enough. How many souls am I sitting on? 9.4. Oh wait, wait, I can actually call you in here. <laughs> I don't think we can fit to get out. Nope. The face is is interminably watching. Let's just sneak out that way, shall we? I want to double check if this merchant has any more keys. I'm pretty sure I bought them all. But I just want to double check while I'm here. Back already. Should be back already? I haven't been back for like 10 hours. What is this? Duplicate ashes. Yeah. Nah, I bought out all of his keys. Okay. Oh wait, you're selling normal arrows, right? You could buy like a grand's worth of them. Oh, good. Have a safe journey. Journey. Sure. Kill him, just one. I'm not killing the merchant because they made it be known very early on that if you kill one, they'll all hate you. I also have no reason to kill him. I want to go spend the rest of the souls I have currently because we might just 
like run around to Mars again, so I'm gonna be dying. Where was the guy who was selling Arts of War? I wanna just buy out his inventory. He was somewhere here. Here? No. Here? Maybe. I think he was here. Yeah, I'm buying out your inventory in case you randomly decide to just leave forever. Which ones sound cool? Eh, we'll go by most expensive. Upward cut? Don't I already have that? I feel like I found that one. Eh, whatever. There. Now it doesn't matter if you die. See you in hell. Until we meet again. Yeah, I know no more than you. I want to see if he vanishes when he's bought out. Nope. Alright, back to exploring now that I don't have any souls to lose. But there's probably still more stuff here. Oh, actually, I could go after that boss. You know, we'll do a break for YouTube, so I'll teleport here, but we'll pick it up there next time against the two cat dog boss.